What is up, Panda YouTube? Today we're going to be watching a Pichu. What? Pichu's still good? Yeah. Niatono has been crushing it in Japan. Kinda always has been, to be honest. But we're going to be watching some of his sets at Sumabato 25, his winner's quarter set, and also his loser's quarter set. So, let's get into it. But before we do, let us know what other characters we should watch. And while you're down there, don't forget to subscribe, turn on notifications, ring the bell. Let's go. I'm surprised he would play Pichu versus Samus. I thought this matchup would suck. Remember when this character was like, top like 10, top five for some people. I still think this character is good. That being said, I am glad that nobody uses this character though, Bo. The less rats, the better. It's an infestation. Uh, bear. Tried to go for Thunder, but kind of had to get around the platform in an awkward way. Ooh, are you, Jesus Christ. Pichu is good in a setting where you know how the player plays. The four tilt went under? Up throw Thunder. That was smart. Woo! Oh, that hey, that's tragic. That's tragic. He, he deserved that stock. I, I wouldn't have been happy about him taking that stock, but he deserved the stock. Like the thing is, Pichu can die really early, obviously, but like Pichu's really evasive and really hard to hit a lot of the time. So it is. It is still is pretty likely that you will. Uh, nice. Live a long time. I also think as a community, we need to talk about Samus up tilt and how silly of a move it is. Back air. You're dead. Yep. It's funny. Niatono's generally kind of a, a, a tier chaser. Like, you know, he's, he's Mr. Pick a top tier, but he is stuck with Pichu. Like, he played Pichu before the nerfs and plays him now. Grab down throw, up air, forward air. Was that a, a coyote jump? There's a technique called coyote jump in this game. Panda, put this in the video, where if you run off the ledge, technically you can still jump for the first couple frames after you are off the stage, but because you're not on the ground, you don't have jump squat the three frames, so you actually just immediately jump, which is cool, which is why that looked kind of weird. He feeling himself now. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie, I say this every time I see it happen, but like getting ledge trapped looks so hard. I wish everyone in the world had ZSS flip jump. Honestly, it is so easy getting back from ledge with flip jump. I wish you guys had it. I want you guys to live in my world. Down throw, up air. Oh no, Nair. There's the up air? Thunder, goodbye. That was clean, that was clean. He Sam take note. I think it was Void doing this with Pichu was why I started doing Up Air Thunder with Pika, so thank you, Void. I appreciate it. This is, this is broken. I hate Pichu. Oh, he, oh he, he's, he's moving. He's grooving. Niatono's Pichu is so clean. His decision making is overall just fantastic. Bro, can we talk, can we talk, can we talk about how all the Pichu mains were like, guys, you could just get camped and Pichu sucks when he gets camped because he keeps doing damage to himself. My brother in Christ, you take 0 0.2 damage when you hurt yourself. It's nothing. This is still doable. This is not, never mind, never mind, sorry. And this is loser quarterfinals. I guess he lost his semis match, don't know to who. Well, now he's playing against a Pisra. Yeah, this is a good pee poo. <laughs> uh. I love how he does those dashes. He's not just holding forward. He's actually dashing each individual time to like make sure he can react to the tech options as best he can. Oh, you're dead. Oh, GG's dude. Get down here. Should have played better, I guess. Don't get down here next time. Okay, well, hold on now. Who, who we supposed to be watching here? Why? Why? I don't think he knows this matchup. This is the most dead pirate I've ever seen in my life. Ah, oh, GG, I got him, GG's. When in doubt, just throw it out. I don't think he wins this game. Look at how big this Thunder Hitbox is. I don't know why, for both Pika and Pichu, they just like, were like, yeah, what a Thunder Hitbox is just like, look, it's supposed to be the cloud, right? But like, look how far away the cloud is from Mithra and it still spikes. It happens for Pichu too, it's really, or Pika too, it's really weird. Hey, hey, that, that was clean. That was clean. I, I, I ain't got nothing else to say, but that, that was clean. Come on, Neotona, he's showing he's showing you up in your own video. Where's my privilege, man? When, when do I get to forward air somebody like this? And it connects. Luminous is doing really good at hitting these, uh, like, I like the swaps that they're doing in, in advantage. No punish, it's sad. And Neotona is now baiting the, uh, 
the Pyra Uppy from Ledge. These are some cheesy characters, that's what I kind of realized. Was Pichu the original Pyra Mithra? Maybe. Pichu's just too risky? Yeah, yeah. It's it's risky, but I kind of look at Pichu the same way I look at uh, Mewtwo, where if you can make your advantage states like so good, it doesn't really matter how, how bad the disadvantage is. <laughs> you know, if you just keep them in, dis in disadvantage the entire time, who can, you can have, you can, you can get hit once and die. Who cares? You keep them in disadvantage. Okay, I right, clean. Add a shield and air attempt, didn't hit. Tech chase, suddenly Neotono's just come alive. Is that death? Oh, you don't f***ed it up. Peach's dash grabs are so good. That and his boost grab, obviously. Very brave to be ready to contest Pyra down air. I like that jump read though, you know, it's Pyra after all. That was really, really well played. Like once he stopped losing, that he was playing really well. Okay, get a little footstool on there. Look at that footstool. I don't think it was an intentional footstool because he did a footstool in there. Not intentional. I'm surprised they even worked with tiny <laughs> baby rat. How, how's the footstool work? The things like the things like the things like half a pound. How you get the foot stood by it? Yeah, he's playing so different. I don't know if it's him playing different or like the the, the flow of this match has very much so changed. I think Neotono just like shirt up on his confidence in terms of advantage, and even if he's like guessing wrong, he's still putting himself in really good spots. Nice, look at that upper back here. Jesus, that was so much damage. You know, I never understood like. How do you like get in? How do you like sneak your way in there as 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 characters like this? Because I feel like their, their, their range is so tiny. What's, what's going on here? What's going on here, the Eterno? Come on! This whole sequence is great. This is like quintessential Pichu. You get a random hit, back air loop, make you mash something, shield it, automatically new, literally had the dash grab attempt, just barely messed it up. That could have potentially been game already. I think even if you tech that, that up smash still kills you, as Pichu specifically. But, you know, you kind of sign up for that when you play Pichu. I feel like there's a lot of characters who have almost as good frame data, but like just way more range and more like consistency in their moves and just more, more, you know. Just better everything, including range, weight, everything. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> got yeeted, okay. Uh-huh, what you got? Nothing. Ooh, ooh, low reset. He's like, oops, I missed, no problem. I'm gonna hit this one though. I like that even though he knows that the Pyro side piece is coming, he still goes for the T-Jolt to go through it because it's like transcendent or whatever. <laughs> it just fell down. Wow, punishes. You love to see it. That's actually an insanely good nair by Neotono. Is that... I'm about to say, if he saved him again. Oh, that's just dead. <gasps> wow, they made that back? I totally agree with the falling back air choice. He keeps like starting off like, okay, whatever. But then he just turns up like this, what's going on? Come on, I hope you. Know, I hope I never play you again. You know, you're a good guy, I know. I like you. But I hope I never see you in bracket again. What do you think of the video? What do you think of Pichu? Let us know down in the comments. And while you're done, don't forget to subscribe, turn on notifications, ring the bell. Bye-bye. <laughs>